What is up everyone, StonePost34. You know, I got to think of the day, um, I'm getting tired of Modern Warfare 3, and I've been playing a little bit of Black Ops here and there. I really don't even play the Xbox much anymore because I struggle with the controller as it is anyway, and I started thinking, I'm not the type of person that likes to sit back and complain. I'm the type of guy uh, that likes to look for solutions. So I started reading online in uh, some of my spare time about what is the solution? Um, is it the next Black Ops 2? Uh, if you follow me on Twitter, you probably know what I'm going to tell you right now. Um, so I started re reading about Respawn Entertainment. Now, Respawn Entertainment was founded by Jason West and Vince Zampella, who, those names might not mean anything to you, but they are the, the creators of uh, Modern Warfare and Modern Warfare 2. And in March of 2010, um, they filed a $36 million lawsuit against um, Activision claiming that they had used much of their material and not been uh, reimbursed for it. In fact, it's getting ready to go to court really soon. Um, and who knows? I mean, that could drag out forever. But that's not my point. Uh, my point is, you know, I'm, I love the first-person shooters. Um, I've always loved them from 007 on the uh, old Nintendos to, um, you know, playing 007 on PlayStation, then finding the Call of Duty franchise. So I've always been a first-person shooter uh, player. So what they have done, and I'll put some links down here in the description, is they went out and founded Respawn Enter Entertainment. And it's Respawn.com, and you follow them on Twitter, it's at Respawn. Um, but they went out and founded Respawn Entertainment. So what we know, and a few things, there's a few rumors here and there, is, um, well, we know first, if it's called Respawn, it's going to be a first-person shooter type game, because that's what they built, they built the engine for and all that. Um, but what we do know is they've aligned themselves with EA Sports. What has been leaked is that EA Sports has set up a marketing schedule for a game launch in 2013 that would be with Respawn Entertainment. Um, now, EA hasn't really been in the first-person shooters. That obviously, they're not in Call of Duty. That's Activision. Um, but interestingly enough, you know, with EA support, which is one of the largest uh, gaming uh, entertainment, excuse me, entertainment companies out there, um, they've kind of got a blank check. And I tweeted out today, I mean, I'm kind of excited about this. These guys are, you, they have to be motivated. I mean, I would be motivated. I mean, if I felt like someone stole something from me, continued to profit on it, and I was given a second opportunity to go out and create something just as good and probably better than what I did for them, I would be stoked. You can go on their website. I mean, it looks like they're hiring people right now. There's a help wanted ads on the website. You can learn about some of their developers, uh, different things like that. The other things that I have read online is this could be possibly a sci-fi FPS, first person shooter. I don't know, like a Halo. I'm not imagining a Halo, but uh, maybe something in the future uh, as far as FPS uh, genres go. Um, the other thing I would worry about, if, okay, if we're talking 2013, it battle, does Battlefield drop again right before um, Call of Duty, and then Call of Duty drop, drops November whatever of 2012, and then do they turn around and, and miss the Christmas season and drop in 2013? So I don't know if we're talking about a 2013 spring, or we're talking about a 2013 fall, possibly. So... Something, it's just, I'm excited about it, guys. Call of Duty's great. Um, a lot of people like to sit around and complain about it. I catch myself doing it, but then I stop myself and try to look forward to the solution. I'm not necessarily saying this is the Call of Duty killer or the COD killer everyone's looking for, but I would say if you're going to kill COD, maybe the guys that help create it are the guys that can do it. Anyway, guys, I appreciate you watching. Take care as always. This is Stonepost34.